I spot some salmon berry. This is a very good ecological restoration sign. Uh, as a native species, the salmon berry shows that you're um, in a ecologically healthy area, which means the restoration here in this residential hiking trail area is uh, has good biological function. Meg really likes this area in here. She said it's perfect for camping because they kind of open up like this where there's a flat zone and some wild animal poop. And that means that the animals like to camp here too. Let's see, we, we go through the trees here, you know, over the river and through the woods to grandmother's house. We're not going because my grandmother's not around anymore. And Meg's grandma lives really far away. So we're just hiking through the woods for fitness and activity. And this is a trail we've never been on to keep it novel. Look at all these mushrooms. Mushrooms recycled dead trees Mycelium. in the forest. Oh, awesome. Yeah. Meg's restoring the ecosystem here. Aww. Don't tear it off. I'm not. Yeah? Have a look. So Have a look at this. Maybe it's a dog. Look at how that complex three-dimensional structure there and these. What they do is they break down the cellulose in the decaying wood and make soil. That's Mushrooms are the forest recyclers. Anywhere you see fallen wood like this, you can see mycelial networks form. And the mushroom is actually the fruiting body. The mycelia is actually the mushroom. The thing we call a mushroom is actually the fruiting body. The part that, you know, like cremini mushrooms that people eat, that's actually the reproductive fruiting body of the mushroom. The actual mushroom is a cellular organism very similar to a fungi. Well, it is a fungi, like bread yeast or brewer's brew yeast. And what they do is they break down starches and cellulose and they eat sugars and make lactic acid and CO2 and ethanol. And that's the foundation of making wine and beer for millennia. For yeah, and so they um, combinations of bacteria and fungi help to recycle nature. And that's what the microbes in our gut flora are actually helping us. There's a hundred billion of them. Um, they're actually helping us uh, to digest our food. In fact, the bacteria in our gut outnumber the cells in our body, if you can believe that, which is why the intestinal flora have, and, and the diversity of them have such a profound effect on the immune system function and on digestive diseases that affect people or proper digestion if there's a nice floral balance. That's why the gut microbiota or body flora is such a trending topic um, in emerging medicine, uh, rich for discovery. Unlike the small molecule pharmaceutical revolution, which is largely tapped out and giving way to monoclonal and polyclonal antibodies or biologics as they're known, insulin being the first one made using genetically engineered bacteria and later yeast. All right, back to the trail hiking. That's your tidbit of science for today. You can see here the trail network we're on, like this. That's Meg and I, we're hiking. You know, get out there into nature, get your heart rate up, breathe the oxygen, saturated air. As the sun hits the green foliage, it breathes in CO2 and breathes out O2. Good for brain function the heart, the circulatory system, everything like that. Let's say it too. I gotta smell it, it smells so good. Mm, that nice? Sweet floral, yeah. It's like a sweet floral honey. Yeah, honey floral dew. Now, I wouldn't normally include power lines in a YouTube video about hiking, but these 750 kVA or 450 kilovolt amp uh, power cables that belong to PSE here. And check out the tower, I'm gonna zoom in. Check out this truss network of triangles here. And you can tell the voltage by the size of the ceramic offset. So this is probably 400, 450 kVA. So that's a medium distribution, so like between cities or substations more likely. So there you go, you learned a little bit about grid power. That's AC, thank you Nikolai Tesla for commercializing AC. I don't know if you can see off there in the distance, but the power cables go all the way down to get up here like this. 